Hey there, it's Murray from Mom Life in a Nutshell, and a lot of you know me from the book that I wrote, Given a Second Chance at Life. And if you haven't checked out my book or read it, go to my website at www.lifenutshell.com and check it out. And I have a lot more than just my book. We've moved to my bathroom because I want to discuss something serious called fetal alcohol syndrome. What is fetal alcohol syndrome, you may ask? Well, I have something called fetal alcohol syndrome. And what fetal alcohol syndrome is, is when your mom drinks with you, when she is pregnant with you through the whole nine months of her pregnancy, and she's been drinking, you have developed what is called fetal alcohol syndrome. And it affects the brain, it can affect you physically, it can affect you in very numerous ways. But fetal alcohol syndrome affected my brain and it also affected me physically, where my arms don't turn like everybody else's. And I have something, I call them ignition arms. And what I mean by that is, you know how when you turn the key over in a car and you can only turn it so far to start the engine? Well, that's how my arms work. They're like ignition arms, okay? So it's like I'm trying to turn the key and with my arms, I can only turn them so far. Everybody else's arms can turn all the way around. Mine, I can only turn so far. And I've even had surgery wah, 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 to try to correct the issue, but it didn't work. You know, living with fetal alcohol syndrome my entire life, I've been bullied, I've been picked on, I've been shredded to bits and pieces by people who are very judgmental and very mean and very insensitive. But fetal alcohol syndrome, just because I have it, it doesn't stop me from doing the things that I love to do. I can do just about anything a normal person can do. I can dance, I can do art. I love to do art. I love to paint, I love to draw, I love to be creative. You would be surprised what somebody with fetal alcohol syndrome can do. In all seriousness though, if you are currently pregnant and you like alcoholic drinks, please refrain from having any kind of alcoholic beverage until after your baby is born because even one drink, you are risking the chance of your unborn child to have fetal alcohol syndrome. People think that I'm not doing my research when I say that one glass of wine or any alcoholic drink can do some damage to an unborn child when in fact you can hear doctors all over the US of A that say there is no safe amount of alcohol to be given any time that you're pregnant because that unborn child, you're risking the chance of that unborn child to have fetal alcohol syndrome. If you are someone who has an alcohol addiction and is currently pregnant, please seek help as soon as you can and as fast as you can. The sooner you get help, the better off you and your baby are gonna live healthier and happier lives without any defects to your unborn child. This is coming from someone who lives with fetal alcohol syndrome and understands what it's about.